Hi there everybody, welcome back to the channel you're watching a Ritter Bit Will Do. And today we are in the process of what are we starting to do Brindley, with our house? What are we starting to put on the house? Christmas lights! Christmas lights! Yeah, it's November, it's not even Thanksgiving yet. But we are in the process of starting to put Christmas lights on our house. And as you can see in the yard, we've got corn stalks, tomato stalks, leaves, debris. We even got a Halloween smashed pumpkin over there that we're going to take care of. I have my flail mower home and I thought why not adjust the flail mower to um, really mulch up everything in the yard. So that's the plan today. That's what we're going to do. So stick around, see how much fun we can have with a flail mower. She's still yapping away. That's your pumpkin? We're going to smash it up even more. Is that okay? Yay. All right. Should we go see if Brielle wants her pumpkin smashed up? Brielle, can we smash up your pumpkin? No way. No way? You're going to take it? I got to take it though. I got to... Oh, all right. I'm not going to fight you. She's emotionally attached to her pumpkin. So we're just going to let her be I for a while. <laughs> you think she fell in love with her pumpkin? <laughs> all right. So we're going to go to the garage. We're going to get that flail mower adjusted right. And then... We're going to grab some fun in the yard, in our residential Daddy, yard, grinding stuff up. It's going to be Daddy, great. I'm Stick around. Yeah, I almost lost you guys. I had you attached to my rolling cart here and you started rolling down the driveway. Don't do that to me. It could have been a real mess. We got it all adjusted. Let's go have some fun. So do we get to uh, run over your pumpkin? No. And flail mow it all up, no. mulch it up? Nope. So it can feed the lawn, make nope. it better? You're pretty nope. attached to it, aren't you? Tell, tell everyone why you love your pumpkin so much. Because I work so hard. Yeah, it's such a pretty pumpkin. But uh, wouldn't you like it to feed the grass for next no. year? No, you're right. not into that? All right. Is it just going to rot? Mm -hmm. You going to save it for next year? Mm. <laughs> okay. Emotionally attached.
kids, this is what happens when you don't pick up your toys. Thanks, camera lady. You did hey, a no good problem. job. I appreciate no it. What do you yeah. think? Is that easier than raking? <sighs> you know, it's a little easier than raking. I was having a lot more fun than I would with a I hand tool. You were. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, if you live in a residential lot and you need a flail mower, you got a lot of leaves, there's an excuse. <laughs> what do you think? Is that a far stretch for an excuse for a flail oh, mower? Well, you know, it might be a little bit. Might be, but sure. if you really, really hate raking leaves like I do, it might help. So. Get yourself a flail mower. Uh, as you know, if you followed my channel, you know that I, I take care of some uh, some land that we have that's up north of here, uh, and that's why I have a flail mower. I've also cut some trails at the school in the prairie field thing that we have, and it's come in really handy. Uh, I've done a video that I've compared it with a brush hog. This leaves such a much nicer, finer cut. Uh, underneath here, as you can see, there's, these are hammer blades. Let me get you in real close. See, these are hammers. They just, they, they go around, they flail around really, really fast. And they mulch everything up just really fine. The really nice thing about it is that it doesn't, doesn't uh, fling stuff out the back. It mulches it up. And when it's finally small enough, then it just kind of drops and it, and it leaves the back chute here. So it's relatively safe. You know, I had, had my wife wearing some safety glasses just in case, but there was there was no problem or danger or anything. It's probably safer than a regular finish mower. In fact, I would say that it is safer than a regular finish mower because it's not it doesn't have a chute that's shooting uh, debris out, however fast it goes. There you go, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, please give me a like, give me a comment, check out our Facebook group, a Ritterbit will do. And until next time, as always, keep on tractoring and God bless. <laughs>